Hi kids, I'm Storytime Pup, and welcome to the Storytime Pup Show. I'm so glad you came by to play. I love when my friends come by to play, and you're one of my friends. Are you ready to have fun? Let's see what we're going to do today. Magic Marker, show us what we're going to do today. Yay! It's storybook time! We love storybook time! Hi kids! Thanks for stopping by to play today! I've got a great travel book for you today! From the Spifford Max series! Today's book is Spifford Max and the Cycle Pups Go to New York City! And it's written by Luisa Mastro Marino! Are you ready? Here we go! Hi! My name is Spifford Max, and I'm the Cycle Puffs leader. I travel with my best friends, Cycle Peter, Cycle Stevie, Cycle Mary, and Cycle Lucy. We love to ride our Max bikes to famous cities and towns all over the world. Today, the Cycle Puffs and I are going to New York City in the state of New York. We're going to see the Empire State Building, Rockefeller Center, and the NBC Studios and the majestic Statue of Liberty in New York Harbor. We can't wait to share our remarkable adventure with you. After our travels, we're going to write a school paper about our experiences. New York City, nicknamed the Big Apple, is a happening history town, said Cycle Peter. We are staying at the world-famous Waldorf Astoria Hotel, added Cycle Lucy. Let's max cycle up Park Avenue between 49th and 50th Street to check into this elegant landmark, said the Cycle Pups. Vroom, vroom, whoosh, away! The Waldorf Astoria Hotel was opened in 1931. The Art Deco-styled hotel was named after cousins William Waldorf Astor and John Jacob Astor, said Cycle Mary. Wow! There is golden gilding everywhere! Look at the crystal chandeliers, said Cycle Stevie. The entrance is lined with elegant furniture and awesome views of Manhattan, said Spifford Max, beaming with joy. Spifford! What is on our itinerary? said Cycle Mary. First, we're going to go visit the Empire State Building on 34th Street. Then we will trek to Rockefeller Center on 49th Street, where NBC has its studios and is hosting the Today Show. We can stand outside the Today Show window with our Max Cycle Bikes, said Spifford Max. Hey, that's a great idea, said the Cycle Pups. Let's visit our hotel rooms and then meet in the lobby of the Waldorf Astoria Hotel where celebrities, royalty, and presidents stay too. Yippee, said Cycle Lucy. Zoom, zoom. Are we ready to visit the Empire State Building, named after the Empire State, a nickname of New York? The Empire State Building was constructed in 1931 and is over 1,400 feet tall, spiraled Spifford Max. Cycle Peter, use your laser watch to show us pictures of the architects who built the Empire State Building. I love them, said Cycle Mary. Architects Shreve, Lamb, and Harmon won a historic contest. Do you know what contest, Cycle Pups? They entered a contest to create the world's tallest building, Cycle Stevie said. Hooray! The Empire State Building stood as the world's tallest building until 1971, said Spifford Max. The Empire State Building's classic elevators lift everyone to the stars. Let's cycle up the building's 102 floors and race to the top, said Spifford Max. I can't wait to look out of the telescopes on the world-famous observation deck, said Cycle Lucy. Wee hee! Oh boy, Cycle Peter, look on the sidewalk, said Spifford Max. I see museums, art studios, and a whole lot of loving people waving back. What wonderful friends in this amazing town, said Cycle Peter. Hooray! I 
can't wait to zoom away and visit Rockefeller Center and the NBC Television Studios. Let's cycle down 5th Avenue and head to 49th Street, yipped leader Spifford Max. Vroom, zoom, away we go! <coughs> Rockefeller Center, built from 1921 to 1940, spans from 48th Street to 51st Street. Rockefeller Center is the home of NBC Television and Radio City Music Hall. We can see timeless shows at Radio City Music Hall, including the famous Rockhead Dancers, said Spifford Max. The NBC studios are located at 30 Rockefeller Plaza. I especially love the Today Show with their legendary hosts. Let's wave our homemade signs outside the Today Show window, said Cycle Mary. My sign says, School Rocks, said Cycle Mary. My sign says, Love One Another, said Cycle Peter. My sign says, We Are One, said Cycle Stevie. My sign says, Peace is Powerful, said Spifford Max. Wow, I can't believe I got to say hello to the television audience, said Cycle Peter. Me too, said Cycle Lucy. We are stars in action all day. Hey, where do we go next? said Cycle Mary. Let's cycle downtown to Liberty Island in New York Harbor to pay homage to the Statue of Liberty, said Spifford Max. The Statue of Liberty was presented to the United States by the French government on July 4th, 1884 to celebrate America's 100th birthday, said Cycle Mary. The Statue of Liberty depicts Libertas, the Roman goddess. The original name of the Statue of Liberty was Liberty Enlightening the World. Liberty means freedom for the masses. Freedom is essential in government, said Cycle Stevie. The colossal statue can be viewed from many places in New York Harbor. Gustav Eiffel designed the statue. He also designed the famous Eiffel Tower in France, said Spifford Max. The Statue of Liberty is made of copper said Psycho Lucy. Over time, the statue has turned green because of oxidation. The inscription on the pedestal, written by Emma Lazarus, American poet, says, Give me your tired, your poor, your huddled masses yearning to breathe free, the wretched refuse of your teeming shore. Send these, the homeless, tempest-tossed to me. I lift up my lamp beside the golden door. Emma Lazarus' inscription is inspiring, cried Cycle Peter and Cycle Maria, weeping with love. What does her historic poem mean to you, Spifford Max? Miss Lazarus' words means that everyone, no matter what ethnicity, heritage, or creed, are welcome to America, said Spifford Max. Ms. Lazarus also encourages people everywhere to preserve freedom in the world, said Cycle Lucy. I can't believe we can ride and ride our bikes around Liberty Island, said Cycle Stevie. Liberty Island is a majestic place. Let's all wave to all the people on the shore. Hey, look at us here in New York City, said the Cycle Pups. What a wonderful view. I can see the rolling ships in the harbor and the famous Staten Island ferry boat. Look at all those amazing and friendly people. I love the way everyone gets along, said Cycle Lucy. Okay, Cycle Pups, said Spifford Max, scooting to the end of the pier. We have had a long day and have seen a lot of sights in a short time. It's time to zoom, zoom, zoom back to the Waldorf Astoria Hotel to get a good night's rest. We can write our school paper together about our adventures. Our paper will be great, said Peter, grinning with joy. Yeah, said Cycle Stevie. New York City is awesome! We have lots to share and to teach everyone, said Spifford Max. I love the Lady Liberty pins that Cycle Mary gave everyone, said Cycle Peter. I can't wait to return to this landmark city and invite all of our readers to join us next time, said Cycle Stevie. Let's ride! Zoom into the sunshine and share new and exciting adventures every day on our amazing Max Cycle Bikes, said Spifford Max.
That's fine, said the Cycle Pops. We love traveling as a team. Teamwork is important. We can't wait to see more wonderful places riding peacefully into the sun. Vroom, vroom, hooray! <coughs> the end. Wow, what an adventure. New York City is an incredible place. There's so much to see. It's so historic. If you get a chance to go, you must go check it out. Maybe you've already been there. If you have, what do you think about New York City? I hope you enjoyed this book. I want to say a great big thank you to Luisa Mastro Marino for sharing this wonderful adventure book for us. We look forward to more Spifford Max adventures. There's one more thing that we always do at the end of every show. Magic glasses. Magic glasses lets me see some of my friends who came to play. Maybe I'll see you today. Magic glasses, that's the way. Show me my friends who came to play. Okay, now everyone smile and wave and let me see if I see you. Well look, I see Mary. Oh, there's Marcos. Well hi Lucy. Well look, there's Anthony waving at me. Oh, I see Debbie and Dina. Well there's Fatima and Diane. And there's Pedro and I see Carol Ann. I see a lot of my friends waving at me. Did I see you today? If not, maybe I'll see you next time. Make sure you check back soon, because we'll be adding a bunch of new shows every week. Make sure you have an adult. Click on the subscribe button right here. That way you won't miss any of the fun. Moms and dads, make sure you visit the Storytime Pup website to sign up for our great free giveaways. We have giveaways for books, CDs, DVDs, T-shirts, and other great stuff. Sign up just once, and you'll have a chance for all the drawings to come. And kids, don't forget to tell your friends about Storytime Pup. And before I go, here's a great big hug for all my friends. Thanks for stopping by to play. I'll see you real soon. Bye now.